Hello, my name is Rob Hirschfeld. I'm the principal architect at Dell. I'm one of the founders of the Crowbar Project that's now in its second year. And we are really excited because we've got five great things on tap for this new Crowbar architecture work that we've just been starting. Uh, and I want to take a second and tell you what they are so you can, you can figure out how to engage and how to use Crowbar in your environment. Because uh, we're taking it beyond the OpenStack and Hadoop deployments that have been really driving the solution forward and making it much more flexible and adapted for environments that our customers have been telling, about, telling us that they are working with. So here's what we're doing. First, we are getting multiple operating support. So it's not just that we can already support more than one operating system, but not simultaneously. We're really working to make sure that the operating systems curve our supports are the ones that you need in your environment. We're also working to make sure that our configuration management integrations, like Chef or Puppet, are much more flexible because we want to be able to work with the systems that you're using, the development and operations automation that's working in your environment. Next, we are making our networking configuration even more flexible and dynamic. Crowbar has been really successful in helping customers get their networking configurations working inside their cloud and operational deployments, but we're taking that to the next level by making it much more dynam dynamic easier to use, faster to set up. The other things we're doing are supporting pull from source. It's an important feature for OpenStack developers so that they can bring in Trunk and use the very latest code for OpenStack or if they're ahead of Trunk and doing innovations and they want to be able to deploy those innovations in their own data center, we're working to support that. And then we're working on something that's really important It brings all those things together that we call online mode. So we're taking Crowbar and allowing it to be fully connected into the internet, pull data in dynamically when it's necessary, and that really is a key for allowing you to do upgrades and um, rolling, rolling management, continuous deployment, all these things sort of come together with these five features. So we feel like we've got five winners for Crowbar 2, and I'm really hoping you'll check it out. Go to dell.com slash crowbar for information about the Crowbar project, and if you want to hear more about the specific features for Crowbar 2, bit.ly. Probar 2 is the place to go for that. Thank you very much.